In this video, I'm going to be showing you the best currently working solo AFK money and RP method in GTA 5 Online after the patch of 1.69. So this is going to be for all consoles and all gens as well. Quickly, before the video starts, at 33,000 subscribers, we are going to be giving away some shark cards. And all you have to do to enter is drop a like, subscribe to the channel, and finally, just comment the word giveaway, and it's as simple as that. Anyway, on to the video. Alright, so first things first, to get started with this AFK, first of all, you're going to scroll down to the description of this video and go ahead and bookmark the job for whichever console you play on. So I will leave three different job links down there, there'll be one for Xbox, one for PC, and then also one for PlayStation. So just click on the link, sign in with your Rockstar account and click bookmark job. And after that, you are going to have to restart your game. But now once you are back in an online session, now open up your pause, go to online, jobs, play job, go to bookmarks, and then come down to survivals and it's going to be right here. On Xbox, it's going to be called AFK Solo Survival 2, so you can go ahead and start this up. Now, of course, if you are on PC or PlayStation, the job name will be different, as it's going to be a completely separate job to the one on Xbox. Instead of spending hours grinding these glitches, check out the quickest and safest modded accounts from DamnMods.com. They have services for Xbox, PlayStation and also PC that come with a range of levels and money on them. You can also get an account boost so your existing account can have money or levels added straight to them. On top of that, you can get modded outfits or even modded cars applied to your account. These guys have over 2,300 reviews on their official Trustpilot page, so you can be sure they are reliable and trusted. I will leave their link in the description and pinned comment. Also, use the coupon code EVADEX to get up to $100 off your order. Once you are on these settings, you can go ahead and change the time of day and the weather if you like. You can also turn off the radio which can be quite annoying. Now for the starting weapon make sure you do select the up anatomizer if you have it. If you don't you can also select a stun gun, but if you don't have any of them just select any weapon, it does not matter. But yeah if you do have an up anatomizer or a stun gun I do recommend you choose that. You can purchase all the ammo and super heavy armor and then start up the job. Now as you can see we're going to spawn inside the job on an xbox you'll be at the pier with a bunch of objects surrounding you and first of all for the first wave i will show you exactly how the job works keep in mind if you're on playstation or pc the job is going to work a little bit different but it'll have the same kind of concept so as you see over here there are some armor and some medkits and stuff and if we come down to the bottom of the pier and look under there's going to be this massive red platform underneath the water so once the wave does actually go ahead and start up if you pay attention to the minimap a bunch of enemies are going to spawn in the distance. Obviously we can't see them as they're going to spawn underneath the red platform under the water, which is basically just going to take themselves out. As of course they're going to drown to the water. And for that, the bar in the bottom right will start filling up until the wave is completed. There will be I think two sets of enemies that will spawn and once they are all taken out the wave will end. So it literally took under one minute to complete the first wave and it will be the same for every single wave of the whole job. Like I said, if you're on PlayStation or PC, it will be a bit different. But yeah, for the second wave, I'll now show you guys how you can actually go AFK without getting kicked from this session. So obviously you can't just stand there and do nothing, you have to do something for in order to not get kicked for inactivity. So if you have the up and atomizer or the stun gun, go ahead and equip that now. And you basically just want to tie a rubber band around your right trigger, and it will just keep on shooting exactly like this. Of course the up and atomizer and the stun gun has unlimited ammo, so you can sit here for as long as you like just holding down the trigger button with a rubber band or something like that. And yeah, simply doing that the wave will be completed. If you go AFK for more than 3 minutes you will get kicked from this session so you do need to make sure you do not go AFK for more than 3 minutes, so literally just set up the rubber band. Now in case you guys don't have an up and atomizer or a stun gun, just equip nothing and I'll tie your rubber band around both of your analog sticks facing each other and you'll basically just run in circles exactly like this. And this method also works. The only issue and why I don't do this method is because over time it can actually cause stick drift on your controller. So I really do not recommend this method but if you don't have an up and atomizer or a stun gun, just go ahead and do this one, don't worry about the stick drift. Because it works the exact same and you don't get kicked from the session. And yeah, that's how simple the job is. So now I'm going to go ahead and complete all 20 waves and show you how much money and RP you get at the end. 
But yeah, keep in mind there is 20 waves in total, and each wave is going to take under 1 minute to complete, so it should take under 20 minutes to do the entire job. But yeah, I'll see you guys once we're done. There we go, as you can see, we are in the final wave now, wave 20. And once it does go ahead and complete, it's going to say reach wave 20. And we got $36,000 and 2,200 RP for literally under 20 minutes of simply AFKing. That is very, very good. Now from here, you're going to be brought to this screen and you can simply click replay to go ahead and replay the job and do the AFK once again and do that for as long as you like. Now for some reason, my controller bugged out. I couldn't actually select anything. But yeah, as long as you select the replay, you can go ahead and do the mission once again. But yeah, anyway, that is going to be the end of this video. That is the best AFK money and RP method in GTA 5 online. So I hope you guys did enjoy. Do be sure to drop a like and subscribe. But anyway, I'll see you guys in the next one.